Good nice. luck, everyone. Thank you. You too. All right. <clears throat> this is a fun... Like, I like the rookie division because... I don't know. It's just like... Especially on Charlotte, I tend to have a lot of fun races. A lot of frustrating ones, but a lot of fun ones as well. And now that... Like, once you get out of rookies, you are finished with that... Um, stigma of like trying to keep your SR up and you can just race and if you get a little bit fucked up then whatever I mean it's not the end of the world you know you're not like four races away now from getting out of rookies so obviously my goal is not to bump into people and not to wreck people but you can actually try to win these races and it's fun I enjoy it anyone in here race in real life I guess we just wait. Oh. Nice Behind job. Go, 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 go. Behind that. Behind I hate shifting in this car so much. Jesus. That was not only not good for the tires, but not good for my momentum either. So we gotta be really careful around this white car because something bad's gonna happen with them. What are you doing? What are you doing? You need to learn how to hold your line. Smoke coming out of the tires already, holy shit. Wow, people are going nuts out here. to get off here being held up. 
That guy got moved out of the way. Wow, this 16 car is a weapon. So let's get right behind him. Trying to conserve the tires a bit by lifting here and there. I know the guy behind me is catching up, but I'm catching up to the guy in front, so... He's going to try to swing in.
Well, we got the lead. He's forcing himself inside. All right, gotta give it to him. The main goal is to keep it as low as possible here. Oh, he's got a good run up above me, though. Hey, we did it! There's the first ever win. Yeah, good race, guys. Very clean. Nicely done. I don't know how to do donuts. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I don't want to do donuts because it's going to end up ruining my SR. But we will do one more victory lap around the track. Hey, what's up, Zombie Slicer? Good to see you again, man. Thank you very much. Hey, you were there for that other time that I almost got a win. Yeah, 
I think you're good luck. One more lap around. I'm pretty sure if I do donuts, it's going to give me X's for uh, losing control and stuff. And I don't want those X's, so we're just going to go and park. That was exciting. That was a good race. You will, eh? Yeah, okay, good. <laughs> I don't want to do that. We'll just park it nice and safe. Like a true professional. Boom, we got it. Ah, oh, my <laughs> I mean, for just a rookie race, it's pretty amazing how my heart was pounding for that. Well, let's take a look. That wasn't very nice. That looked hard enough to give me X's. Did I get X's? Nope, no X's. Yeah, it was a really good race for the last few laps. They were getting good runs. I was starting to... My tires were starting to wear right out. I think the blue car that I was chasing for most of the race ended up with, uh, like, even worse tires than me. That Yeah, that sucked right there. That really felt like he just sort of shot me up there, but I think I just reacted poorly to it. Oh, uh, we totally have time for Kansas as well, so that's good. I think he just slowed down, and I had to try to get out of his way. Speed it up a bit. This uh, 16 car was something else. Like, he was aggressively driving right from the start. You're always going to find one or two guys who do that. Yeah, there was a wreck. You'll see it here coming up. The 16 car, you can see, like, really doesn't feel comfortable driving close to other people. Maybe not all the time. Like, sometimes he's able to do well. But, yeah, this was right when I said that he... I don't know if it was right here, if maybe it was the next lap, but I was like, man, this guy's a bit of a weapon. And uh, oh, I almost did the same thing to the 11 there. Almost lost it a little bit, got loose going into that corner. This car gets loose, like, pretty often. I feel like I'm loose a lot of the time, actually. <clears throat> yeah, this was pretty dangerous to ride behind for a bit. And then, boom, 16 comes up, hits the 5 out of the way. We're able to stay out of the fives way. We'll take that position. We're in fifth now. Blue car makes a nice pass on the orange. <clears throat> oh, the six. Oh! He totally could have taken me out there, but he actually ended up saving my life by not doing that. Did he mess up other people behind him? I think he might have. Here he comes. Boom. Stays off me. Oh, no. He, he saved it. It was the 16 and the 2, I think, that orange car. Right here. We went high, got out of the way. And then... 
Yeah, they caused a bit of problems. They hit the five as well. Slowed some other people down. Five came back out onto the track. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at that car. <laughs> Crazy. And then from here, it was mostly just like me trying to slowly catch up to the blue. I did have the six right behind me. Trying to pass. He was pushing me a little bit. He bumped me a couple times. But they were zero X's. So I let him pass here. Hold on. Let's slow it down a bit. We got past the lap car. No problem. And then I realized I was starting to gain on the number 10 here. Yeah, that guy went flying. And this is where the race got really good. Well, the three of us raced very well together, I think. I'd say the six was a little wanting to get in there pretty bad, a little aggressive, but hey, he didn't bother me too much. Too bad I didn't have uh, the G-Dog car. This is one of those cars that I wouldn't mind having a G-Dog uh, paint job for, by the way, Ham. I know I didn't send you the template, but I know you're doing shit with your uh, fresh install and stuff, so I'm not going to bug you right now about it. <coughs> but I race this car fairly often. Managed to get a run there, got past him. And now we're in the lead with five laps left. It's probably going to be better to watch from here. You can see the smoke there. Here's where I thought it was going to be like third place for me because he got fully past me and the six was getting inside as well. To be honest, I'm not even really sure how I managed to get around it, especially racing from the outside. But I guess he had to slow down way too much to stay on the inside. So I got the run on him here. Six is pushing me again a little bit. And here I was able to cut in two laps to go. Well, three actually, I think. Look at that smoke. Oh yeah, they were gonna go three wide on me here, I think. Now, at this point, I was sort of being a little bit more aggressive with getting in the way, because when there's only a couple laps and I had a chance for my first ever win, I really didn't want them to, uh, to mess with me too hard. He's getting by me right here. <clears throat> He's officially in first as we come around this corner, but again, somehow I just had a better run on the straight. Yeah, big time, man. More smoke. Ten coming in. The six falling back. <clears throat> We're three wide. Nobody messed anyone up. Look at that. How amazing is that? <clears throat> oh, six hit the wall there. I didn't notice when he ended up falling back. And we, here we are on the last lap. More smoke. You know, I never see other people's tires smoke like that. I don't know why the 10 did that. He ended up giving up a couple positions just because of that. Look at him bouncing over there. And there we go. G-Dog Casey's first ever win.